welcome back to KG Gaming, guys. In today's video, we're carrying on the Hunt Call of the Wild series where we hunt the most dangerous game in the animals. So far, we've done water buffalo, we've done coyotes, and we've done grizzly bears. But in today's installment, we're going after a big cat. Possibly even a very big cat. But it's not the biggest cat. We're going after the cougar. Now, do not underestimate the cougars. That was my elementary school mascot. We may or may not have went 12 and 2 that year. No, 2 and 12. Yeah, yeah, it was pretty bad. But we won two games. A win's a win. Anyways, before we go out there looking for some big cats, I want to be ready. And uh, even though they're a big cat, they're a cougar, okay? Pretty respectable. Hold up. Is it raining? Oh, dang, it's raining. Hold up. Anyways, even though it is a cougar, pretty big animal, I don't think they're the biggest animal. So we don't exactly need giant guns to take them out. For today's video, I'm still going to be keeping the bow. They're going to be keeping the buckshot. But I'm going to be throwing in something a little bit different. I'm going to be throwing in the 6.5 Creedmoor. Personally, I think it has a chance to do great. And I'm also going to throw in the 270. Because this thing's a hoss cat. So we Tracks are my go-to source for insight into animals in the reserve. That I know there's a lot of big species. cats. And that's way over here. Now, we may have to shoot half a mile to hit them. But I do know there's, there's a lot of cougars here. Ah, right, boys, let's get after it. First things first, we're pulling out our binos. We're going to start glassing. Now, if you are new to this channel, new to this series, I'm just going to put these disclosures up front. That way there's no confusion in expectations. Yes, I am hunting for cougars, but I will shoot whatever I see. All right, now that we got that out of the way, let's start hunting. All right, there's bighorn sheep. Little far. I don't think I showed you guys this, but I also have the distressed fawn call, which should be able to call it in cougars pretty good. Cougars, mountain lions, pumas, whatever you want to call them. Oh, snap, dude. We're getting on it early. We done got a mating call. That's a black bear, but if I see it first, I'll shoot it. I'm gonna say let's just walk slowly, get a little bit closer, and uh, we'll keep glassing the whole time, and then we might even hit the call, because that call can bring them right in, dude. It does. Let me set up in this cedar tree, and we'll hit the call one time. <laughs> coming running the bear's coming running this is gonna be sick dude this bear i think is coming right into the call he might come into boat range or i might even get to shoot him up close personal with the buckshot he's definitely coming in i'm gonna try to get over here to this fur one thing about those predator calls though you gotta watch your back because there could be a, a mountain lion walking up at any moment just ready to grab the back of the neck and twist it and just snap your neck and then eat you feed its kids Dude, that bear is gonna walk right up on me. Oh, he's risking and run. He doesn't know I'm here yet. That's a frontal shot. That's not a good shot. That's not a terrible shot. What's the bear doing? He's running the wrong way. Ah! Dude, the bear's going to catch my wind. He's 53 yards. I got this buck moving in too. I could send it right through there, but dude, I just don't want to do that. I need him to turn broadside. I, 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 I can wait. I turn. I turn. He's gonna catch my wind. He's gonna catch my wind. He's gonna catch my wind. Oops, oopsie. <laughs> Headshot. I'll take it all day. Why couldn't he just been normal and stopped? I had to shoot him in the face. Anyways, nevertheless, I. Oh my goodness. He's still running. Oh my gosh. Get the 6 5. Let's finish this. He's gonna come right through there. Zoom in, buddy. There he goes. That's him. That's the bear. Hold up. I have an idea. We're gonna jump out in front of him. This is so dumb that it might just work. Oh, dude, I think it is. I think it's gonna work. It is. He came this way. We're not far behind. Him. This is honestly just unfortunate that I had to shoot a bear in the face and still not kill him. We're literally not even hunting bear. This is a mountain lion hunt. Well, at least he's dead. I'm calling cap on that. That's not real. That's fake. It's glitched. I didn't hit him there. I shot him in the face. I know I did. I'm gonna try to find a mountain lion this time because that's pretty important for a mountain lion hunting video. We're gonna pull out the 6.5 for a little practice just to make sure everything is working okay. Oh, hold up a second. Wait, we're not gonna do a little target practice. Because we have an actual albino mountain lion over there. All right, here's the thing, guys. It's on the other side of the pond. I'm not walking around. I'm going to walk to the edge of this pond. We'll set up and we'll try to make our best shot. And then there's another mountain lion right above it, but it's not albino. So we're not going to shoot it. All right, guys, this is going to be kind of a long shot. It is 250 yards away, and I'm going to be shooting it with a 6.5 Creedmoor. Get a good prone position. Final, final yardage, 218, final distance. I can literally zoom into its soul with this, but I need that thing to turn turn broadside. I don't want to take a shot that's not broadside. I know I could land a shot right there and kill it, but I don't want to. I want it to be broadside. There's another one. I could also slide one right in behind the shoulder, but I don't want to. I want to take an ethical broadside shot because that's who I am as a video game hunter. Jamal, what are you doing? Move. That thing has not moved. I'm going to shoot it and I'm probably going to miss it. 
Alright, there, I did what I did. I did what I did, and I can't take it back. It stopped. Perfect. Well, I'm gonna shoot that other one. <laughs> oh, it just jumped in the lake. How far is it gonna go? Where's that other one? Where's that other net? It is a long shot, and I mean a long shot. But is it a long shot I'm willing to take? Domed it. Dome pieced it. It ain't going far. It's dying. Dude, it's dying. It's dying. Okay, I thought it was dead. Dude, that cat's running all over the place. Maybe I missed it. <gasps> There's another one. There's another one. Approximately 250, I can take it with the 6.5. Actually, with the 270. Should have been a neck shot, but you know, I'm not the most accurate hunter call the wild player in the world, but it's the thought that counts. Did I even hit that thing? We'll go over there and we'll look for blood. There's another one, there's another one. Oh, dude, that smoked him. What's up with me and all these false claims, dude? I'm not trying to be wrong. I literally, I genuinely do think that they're going down. It's just that they don't. What the heck is this? What the heck is this? Oh! And just so you guys are aware, this is how you take one of the most dangerous animals in the game and turn it into one of the least dangerous hunts. In today's video, I had more of a chance of getting hurt by that big horn sheep charging me than any of these mountain lions because I'm literally shooting them across a lake. All right, Jamal, start tracking. Hold up one second. I think I see the white one. Is it an albino? It's not albino, it's gray. You know what's crazy though on a real note? That 6.5 really did hit it in a perfect spot. A single lung, not amazing, but still pretty good. Everything seems to be pretty good. It was a 217 yard shot, but I hit it pretty well perfect. Only made 900 bucks. What a scam. Gets them every time. Man. If we do not have five different mountain lines stacked up over here, I'm going to be a little upset. Maybe this 6.5 is just a Like, for real. Maybe the 6.5 is just a terrible gun. Maybe that's an upcoming video, guys. If you want to see me do a deep dive, which for me isn't very deep at all, on the 6.5, I'll do it. I'll suffer through it. Is the 6.5 the worst gun in the game? Next video, I'm going to be testing out the 6.5, and I'm going to be seeing how terrible it actually is. All right, Jamal, look for bodies, look for bodies. One body, got him, son. What is this, where'd I hit him at? Hit him once, right in the shoulder, scapula, something. Oh, hello there. Oh. How are you doing today? Literally can't kill that thing at point blank. Oh. Can't even do that. Jeez. Where'd oh. I hit this at? Oh. Once in the neck, oh. and then once in the belly. In the back leg, you look at that and you tell me how that didn't go through and hit the lung. Sorry. Oh. I mean, yeah, sorry. It grazed the leg. So it grazed the leg fur and stopped it from going into its lungs? I don't think so. Anyways, guys, I'm gonna have to stop playing this before I have a... Before I... Ah! I have a serious question. Have I really been a floating head all this time? I forgot I was wearing camo. 